We have all the receipts of what Liverpool are doing this season, winning games left, centre and right. And if there is anyone who had an imagination of uh, Liverpool scrambling after Jurgen Klopp's departure, that was a bad imagination because it will never happen. That will never happen. Right now we are witnessing a totally different Liverpool. And Anna Slat is turning Liverpool players into prime Ronaldo's and Messi's. I even wonder why Mo Salah was not in the list of Ballon d'Or 2024. Being 5 points ahead of Manchester City and 10 clear points ahead of Arsenal is a clear picture that Liverpool are not here to play. Liverpool are here to challenge for titles. And it is a clear evidence that Liverpool might be winning the Premier League title this season. Not only the Premier League title. We've seen Liverpool doing really well in the Champions League games. And the only team that will be scaring Liverpool this season is Barcelona. In the last 11 games, Liverpool have won 9 games. And not just winning games. You are talking about comfortable winning games. Mo Salah making history of being the first Liverpool player reaching 10 goals this time of the season is a clear picture of how Mo Salah is good this season. We are seeing a totally different player from the player we knew last season. What he's doing in the Liverpool wing is just everything that all these other teams want their wingers to be doing. The duo ship is having with Darwin Nunes, one of the players that many people knew he was never good enough to play for Liverpool. And Liverpool made a mistake of signing this player into the team. Right now we are talking about a totally different Darwin Nunes. He is even much better than other strikers in the Premier League. And if what is being done right now at Liverpool will be done the same way for the next two seasons. Darwin Nunes will be one of the best strikers in the league and he'll be in a position of scoring 25 or so goals for Liverpool in a season. The only remaining part right now for Liverpool if they really want to win the Premier League title this season is getting free points in the game against Manchester City. And that's when we're gonna believe Reds got no money but they're gonna win the league. Konata showing class in that defense line is so inspiring for Liverpool fans. Because if Vajay Van Dijk will be leaving the team, they know they still have the best in that defence line. And if Vajay Van Dijk will continue with his career at Liverpool, it will be even much better for Liverpool having two talented, experienced players in that defence line. And they'll be even more ready to go and challenge for any title. Their first Premier League game after the break will be against Southampton, of which it will be a winnable game for Liverpool. Then they'll be facing Real Madrid for their Champions League game. Then the most awaited game against Manchester City on 1st December.